Good morning, Joelle and May. Day 38 of my 60-day guided meditation commitment. I had started the video, but when it was getting all crooked in the holder, it stopped. And you know me, I don't know how to edit, so I'm starting over. <sighs> anyway, so I got the glowing candle right here, because, yeah... Oh my gosh, so, blah, my hair is bothering me. Since it started over, let's see, where was I at? Okay, it's day 38 of my 60-day guided meditation. Last night, I listened to, was it the Rewire Your Brain, I think? It's a seven and a half hour meditation. I woke up when I noticed it was done. I'm not sure what time that was this morning. I went to the bathroom and then I put on my morning meditation, which was a chakra alignment meditation, and it was an hour something long. So I have no idea what time it is because I still don't know where I put my other phone. Yeah, I know. Goofy, right? And if I try to look at the time, it might stop the video again. So I might didn't touch my phone again. <laughs> so I don't want to start over a third time. I love the way my hair looks, but it's tickling me everywhere. I just want to rip it off. <laughs> oh my goodness. Anyway, so last night's meditation was very relaxing. Like I said, it was the rewire your brain meditation. Um, I had a very hard time staying in this meditation this morning because I went straight from sleep meditation to bathroom to next meditation and all the things I wanted to want to do today kept running about in my head. I think there was about five times I wanted to stop the meditation this morning because I was just getting too anxious. But I pulled through and I'm glad I did because by the end I was able to be a little more relaxed. So I feel better than I did when I started even though I wasn't really awake when I started if that makes any sense. Um, yeah. Where did I put all my hair today? I don't know. I took them out while I was falling asleep. I literally took my hair out while I was falling asleep. So, I think they should be somewhere around here. But I don't see them. I see one. So I just put up half of my head. Got a little kooky. Right? A little kooky. Having half of my hair done. I don't know. I always have to do the first one twice until I get them pulled apart. Because the hair always likes to go back together. <laughs> All right. Kind of silly. Not really sure what to say this morning. I think it's Sunday, May 22nd. I think. If I have my days right. I'm not sure. Goofy. I always feel goofy and I always feel off balance. <laughs> this morning's video helped me feel a little more in balance. But right now I just feel completely disoriented, not knowing where the rest of my hair ties are. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that we're three quarters of the way through May already. Like, summer's supposed to be here. I don't know. It was hot yesterday. I actually put the air conditioner on. But now I'm too cold. I want to go turn it off. Oh yeah, I need to do my morning drink. I mean, I put four in my hair now. It shouldn't be that hard to find. I don't know why I have this one looks by itself. I know, I'm not really knowing what to say at this moment. I'm still groggy. Um, 
I know I'm usually better at this in the morning when I'm not so groggy, but like I said, I was having a very hard time staying in the meditation because I just kept thinking about everything I had to do today or that I want to accomplish, I should say, because, you know, we don't really have to do anything ever. You know, it's what we want to accomplish, is what we want to strive for. Mm -hmm. I have to get over the fact that this has stevia in it. At least the lemon flavor kind of covers it up. And the first initial flavor that comes in is beet and pomegranate. So that's nice. I was trying to look up the ingredients last night separately and I was falling asleep. Because mm -hmm. I like to research everything that I do or take. So with yesterday's video, I left with watching the Q&As. They were really interesting. Um, I don't know why it was a separate category from um, Dr. Joe's Dispenza's other stuff, but let's see. I can bring, I can bring the candle up a little higher since it got dark again. There we go. Two boxes. That helps a little bit, maybe. I don't know. Is that too high? Okay. So, where was I? Oh, I hate it when I space out like that for little things. Yeah, my mind's still a little foggy. I've been taking these things for two days. I did get a lot of cleaning done yesterday, so I'm very happy about that. Um, I was working in the kitchen for most of the day. I still need my dad to help me fix the washing machine. I need to go buy duct tape today. I need to go buy a new router today. The rainstorm blew my router. I mm, was not expecting that finance, but anyway. So now I have to venture out in the world again today. So that'll be interesting. Hopefully, I wonder if it'll be as much fun as when I went to see the herbalist. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, I'm braiding my hair and I have no hair tie to put in it. Oh, this is nuts. I don't know what to do. I don't understand how they're not right next to my bed. Because I remember pulling them out when I was sleeping. Doesn't make sense. Oh well. I don't know. It's strange. Anyway. To the meditations. Uh, this morning's meditation was um, energy center meditation so he took you through eight energy centers or eight chakras however you want to put it he says he doesn't like using the word chakras because a lot of people um, have um, emotional attachments to that word which makes sense I can understand that as I've had a lot of people when they say chakras they give me funny looks so straight off the bat Intense. It says you're supposed to do like 16 ounces of water. I do it with eight so I can finish drinking it faster. <laughs> I do that with most drinks. Let's say eight ounces of water. I don't know. I don't like things tasting watery. I guess. I don't know. How to do this without a hair tie. <laughs> Not a practical hair tie, it's skinnier than normal, but, oh wait, 
Did I grab my little, oh, yeah, I grabbed my little one. So not quite the same, but it's a little bigger than that one. <sighs> now my hair won't be tickling my face anymore, thankfully. <clears throat> so this morning's meditation, that's what I was getting into, is the energy chakras, uh, energy centers, because he was, he was running us through eight of them. So I think the video was an hour and a half. The breathing isn't as tense, but then it is. I don't know. Um, it's a different breathing pattern that he'll have us do as we're integrating all the chakras together. Because um, we'll start with the one and then um, he'll run through the cycle on one and then I'll go to two and then he'll run the cycle on one and two and then it'll continue like that. So when you get up to eight, you're running all eight uh, energy cycles together. And he's always reminding you to focus on the crystallized, the crystals of your pineal gland. In this particular video, so if you want to, if you don't want to do breathing, this is not the video, but it's not as intense as some of the other breathing exercises because it's like a lot more breathing in and breathing out, breathing in and breathing out, then breathing hold and release. I find the breathing hold release a little more intense than breathing in and breathing out, but I think that's a pers personal preference on what you think would be more intense. Uh, it just depends on how you're used to breathing, I guess. You know, because originally we used to breathe through our pineal gland before we learned how to breathe through our mouth and nose. You know, like when we were in the womb, and before we were created into human essence. But anyway, that's, I don't have my notes or theories written down on that. It's just thoughts at this point. Well, at least I got three hair ties in. I'll find another one to close that one up later. But at least my hair is not tickling my face anymore. <laughs> I was just trying to tickle me. <laughs> ah, the one hair tie came out. <laughs> I guess it's time to put the other two together. It's a little different. But it's better than a ponytail because it doesn't sit in the middle of the back of my head in the same way. So I'm less likely to get a headache this way. I know, right? Kind of kooky, but it works. It works. It helps. It does. And sometimes I'll like feel a little pressure like on one of them. But not right now. <laughs> and when that happens, I just rebraid the hair and the pressure kind of relieves itself, which is nice. Yeah, so today's meditation, focusing on energy centers and everything and rushing the energy through my body to alignment and everything, it's really nice to touch on all of them before starting my day so I can feel a little bit more focused on me, I guess. I don't know. But, um, yeah, if you want, if you feel a little off or sluggish, off-center, 
this is a good meditation because it takes you through all your energy centers so your body can be more free flowing so you can feel a little more rise up in your spine yeah I guess that's the best way to put it <laughs> anyway so I gotta get myself ready and go buy a router today so I can use my TV again because yeah my roommates want their internet last night one roommate came back from being out of town and he's like I can't fill out my application tonight I'm like, the one main cord works so like you can plug your computer into that but for everybody else and that's only in the middle room it's a four or five bedroom house depending on how you look at it anyway with that I'm gonna get ready for my day and I'm gonna say I love you and I love me and you love you and I'll take care of me and you take care of you and we'll be good remember subscribe leave like and comments down below I'm always interested in what you have to say and I'll gladly respond and see if I can help or just be a friend yeah and with that I'm gonna say have an amazing grand rising you beautiful souls mm -hmm. <laughs>